Folks know this, so this family of five spent the last 10 months traveling the world to track their, to track their lineage. They didn't bring that song. And they're here in, ja in Jamaica to tell us about this amazing journey. And it must be. We have the father, who is beside me, Ike Anderson, the mother, Natalie at the end, and the kids, Jasmine. Put up your hand there, Jasmine. Mm. Kaylee and Leighton. Did I pronounce everyone's name yes. correctly? Yes. yes. Morning. Welcome morning. to Smile Jamaica. Welcome back to Jamaica. Thank mm -hmm. you. Give me a quick history of your Jamaican roots before we, you tell me what you, you, you're doing. Yes, yeah, so Jamaican roots. I was born here in uh, St. Elizabeth, Santa Cruz. I uh, grew up my whole life until 16. I migrated to the States. Um, yeah, so I went to Santa Prep, Monroe College. Okay. So strong roots in Jamaica. Yeah, I apologize for that. You could have got, <laughs> could have got charges instead of that. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> so what? You just get up one day and say, I want to find out who is my, my great, 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 great. No, man. I think over in, in time, you, you you work and you know everyone tell you, you go to school, you get a good education, you go to work and you make a lot of money and signify success. And, you know, I went through that process and I got what I would determine was my success, but something was missing. And, you know, once I started looking into things, I realized that there's a bigger world out there and an open mindset. And, you know, going through that process, I wanted my kids and my family to be a part of it. So a part of that was traveling yeah. and exploring different places and learning things that affect us specifically. So, moms, when you, you, you hear that you're going to pack up and travel the world to find out, you said what? Yes, quick before he changes his mind. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the adventurer, so that, it, it came naturally to me. First move was what? To, what you had to do to, to figure out? Well, the first move was actually the hardest move, was to decide. And once we decided, uh, going through the process of detoxing, what I called. So emptying all the stuff that we've gathered over the years and realized we really don't need them. Right? And you can't pack them and carry them with you. So going through that cleaning up process and minimizing all the material things and getting light was very important. Yeah. So that was the first thing. And the first place you went? First place we went was Mexico. Why? Mexico was one of those places at that time was very appealing because a lot of people don't understand that a lot of Africans were over on this side of the planet before there was slavery. And they think it's just slavery. So there was some Olmec people in Mexico that yeah. was very appealing. So we went there to start the journey with that information. All right, um, Jasmine? Yes. When you realized that you were gonna pack up and leave some of your friends for a while, what, what was that like for you? It was fun, I guess, because I really wanted to go out because I, don't, I wasn't really like, fond of school. I'm more of like a person that likes to go out, explore. So I was excited. Okay. Um, Kaylee, how many countries have you been to? 16 countries so 16? far. 16? Yeah. Whoa! What's your favorite one? Um, they all have their specialties for different types of things, but my favorite would have to be Mexico for the food. For the food? Yeah. <laughs> for the food? Yeah. <laughs> what, what's, what's so good about the food? What, what um, do you like here? Well, I like guac and chips, so their specialty is known for guac, I guess, so I really liked it. Leighton, good morning, sir. Good morning. First place you went to would be where? Mexico also, right? Yes. And, and the favorite place so far would be? My favorite place was Hawaii because of the beaches. <laughs> so fun. Not the food, the beaches. <laughs> yeah, beaches. And you, food, are are you guys tired of the traveling just yet? No. 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 You still want to travel? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yes. <laughs> For the food. <laughs> <laughs> For the beach. And for you, what? I like beaches and food. <laughs> Moms, what about schooling and stuff? How, how do you manage that? Uh, we did homeschooling, so a lot of online programs. So as long as we had internet connection, I was able to, and then there's life schooling. Instead of telling them about the pyramids, we went to the pyramids. So Brilliant. there's nothing better than that. A book couldn't tell you all yeah. of that. Anything that really surprised you thus far? Well, I think the surprises just keep coming. And I think that's one of the, the things that's so inspiring with this whole thing for me. Because when we did this, it was for them, but it became a journey for me personally. Um, going back to Ghana, um, West Africa, and going through you know, where our ancestors came from, the journey they took, 
made me realize just how powerful we are here in Jamaica. Yeah. And the journey that most of the people went through to get there wasn't good. So only the strongest of the strongest survived. Yeah. So it made me realize just how strong we are as a people and you know get really core to myself as far as yeah. who I am and the purpose I, I'm I guess here. if you look back you're talking about great 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 have you found anyone alive yeah man so with the whole DNA process you can match and see people you're related to so we met people in Nigeria that's fifth sixth cousin from the maternal line um, we met third fourth cousins in Canada that we I wasn't even aware of did they know about you guys? no 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 but when we tracked it we found the, the route and you know we had a few reunions along the way which was amazing where else or what else is left have you found all the way back the great 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 yeah great. man so i'm back to 1732 1732 yeah so most people still here in jamaica believe it or not in the cockpit country where most of those people are so a part of when why we're here this time is to go deeper into the roots of our jamaican ancestry and tie it all together yeah 16 countries, you're probably going to end up with about, what, about 20, 20, 20? About 27 by the end of next yeah, year. Oh, you're going to live after that. You're not going to just board to just go back and say, <laughs> <laughs> what are you going to do after no, that? No, man, we have some amazing opportunities in the, in the pipeline right now. So Fantastic. So, What do you guys do before you started this? What, what, what did you do? Yeah, so I'm an entrepreneur. I own online businesses. So with that... Businesses. Well, with that, it gives me the opportunity to be remote and to be able to still work while be able to have a balance with the family. I was just going to say that because this must cost a pretty penny. Well, I think cost is relative. Yeah, yeah it's, but it it's, must cost a pretty penny still. Well, yeah, it's pretty, but <laughs> <laughs> it, it's not about the money. You can't bring it. The experience and giving them the opportunity to see things and experience things. For me, that, that, that's the most important thing. So if, it costs me more if they don't do that. Yeah. yeah. That's me not tired of this flying all over the world yet? No, I like flights. I like planes. Oh, you love planes? Mm hmm oh. Whoa. I like them. Katie? Um, I'm not tired of it. I still Layton, you kind of look like you're a little bit tired of it. <laughs> no. <laughs> no? No. What are you going to be when you grow up? I want to be a photographer or I own my own beauty school. Own your own beauty school? Mm-hmm. I want to be a model or make clothes. Model and? Make clothes for people too. And make clothes. I want to be an illustrator and make graphic novels. Wow. I just, I just feel dunce. <laughs> <laughs> don't laugh, man. Don't, don't laugh. I, don't, I know your sister very well. Um, very contact her sister. But I, but I love her proper. Hey, Moya. Yes. It is great to meet you guys. How long are you here? We are for 10 days. And when you came? Uh, yesterday morning. OK. Yeah. So how do you? Well, you keep a journal, what, what, what do you do? You, you put everything together? Yeah, so it's, that's a part of the schooling that we, we, we have implemented with the kids and for us is journaling. So that's a part of our daily ritual is journaling in the morning and gratitude journaling at night. And you know, we went back a year and seen some of the stuff that we've wrote, written and just how we've grown. Um, Layton really does a really good job with his journaling, really. You know, he doesn't Easily. like it, but he does really good. <laughs> so, uh, it's fantastic anyways. to meet you guys. Um, Thanks for having us. God, bless, for having God us. bless you all. Be safe. Be safe. But send, like how you're here, send back some pictures. We're looking, we've been looking at the, the videos and stuff. But uh, send back some stuff for us so we can um, keep you in the loop and let everyone know what's going on. Well, what's everyone can follow our journey on like Instagram, Exploring Legacy. And on Facebook, Exploring Legacy. Yeah. Or Exploring Legacy. You, like you said 27 countries, but when does it end? There's well, a, listen, there's an end date here? There is no end date right. until there's the end date. All right. <laughs> I can listen, Father, Natalie Anderson, Mother, and children, Jasmine, Kaylee, and Late Anderson. Still to come, Digital Launch is their Christmas promotion. And for 10 minutes to your health, we look at epilepsy. News in 5 is next. Stay with us, please. We'll soon come.